What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel, Sarah Marguerite. <laughs> so um, today's video, I have to look like this, but today's video is about makeup for people that wear glasses because I wear glasses and I don't have any more contacts at this present time. I just ordered some more, but yeah. So if you wear glasses and you also wear makeup, but you just need some more tips and things on what to do, please watch this video and don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel and tell a friend to tell a friend to do the same. Let's get right into it. Okay, so I am carving out the brows with some concealer from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And for the brows, I actually use their pomade in the shade Dark brown and I actually love the way that my um, brows turned out because I have always been using pencils but I really like the pomade so I was like okay these are some nice bold brows it looks lit so for the primer I used Maybelline's Master Prime and this is the hydrating one and it's actually really good. It definitely feels light on the skin. It doesn't have like an oily kind of feeling. It feels really, really good. So now I, I am just going in with the Maybelline Super Stay Foundation in the shade Mocha. And on camera, it does look a little bit orange but in person it definitely looks better i don't know why it looks so orange maybe it's because like the the um lights i have are so bright i don't know but anyway <laughs> i am now going in with the maybelline age rewind concealer in the shade tan like wow i'm just using a lot of maybelline's products but that is my favorite 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 drugstore brand maybelline mm-hmm but with this concealer, I definitely like it. This was actually my um, first time like uh, testing it out and stuff. One of my favorite um, YouTubers, which is Jackie, 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 I know. <laughs> she she um, definitely likes it. And we are both in the shade tan. So I just had to, I had to try it out for the good auntie, okay? I'm going in with the Patrick Star quad from MAC. It was his first launch and there is a color called Amber Lights one from that quad. It's a really really nice gold and I am going to set that with the Maybelline Fit Me Loose powder in the shade Medium Deep and I believe that this powder is okay. It's not one of my favorites. Um, This was actually my like um first time using it and it was good it's just too neutral for my skin tone and stuff i actually prefer something a bit more on the yellow side so i need to go back to sasha buttercup powder that is my favorite one that is my jam and i just tried to to be different but i ended up not really liking this powder but that's just my personal opinion my personal experience okay okay um now i am contouring my face with the anastasia uh beverly hills contour powder in the shade carob and i am just kind of contouring out my ch cheekbones and like around my hairline as well as my jaw and i also contour my nose so when you wear glasses people don't necessarily see like your eyes when I wear glasses and wear makeup at the same time I just tend to focus on the skin I think that that is the most important part um, so I just took some blush by um, Juvia's Place in the shade Serafina, which is a nice coral color. It's like a pinky coral and it's really, really nice. And I got a new highlighter, guys. You guys already know that I was obsessed with the Carly Bible palette. And then I was like, no, let me just try out something else, you know. So I actually tried the Anastasia Beverly Hills collab with Amrezy. And the packaging is what's up. And 
it's a very nice highlighter guys like a glow from within type of thing and this is a product that doesn't look like it's just kind of sitting on your like cheeks because I hate oh I, I hate when people do that okay so then I am going in with the ColourPop liner in the shade um honey dude and it's a nice nude and for people that wear glasses I think that a nude type of liner kind of just um brightens up the eye and it just looks really good and I am not going to wear lashes for this look because when I have my <laughs> glasses on I don't want my lashes to be um, touching my lenses or, or things like that because it just gets really, really irking and nobody has time for that. So I actually went in with with the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara in Black is Black, I believe, and it's a really good mascara because it coats the lashes as well as like um, separates them. And it just looked really nice. And for lips, I use the NYX Suede Lip Pencil in the shade Club Hopper. And I just went in with some with some NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the shade Athens. I am just kind of deepening the crease with the Patrick Star Quad once again. There's a soft brown in there and it's really really nice and I'm just going back in with the Am Reezy highlighter for the for the inner corner just to kind of add some more brightness so that way my eyes can appear to be a little bit bigger and it just kind of like brightens everything up and now I am adding some brow gel to the brows and this is just going to help the hairs stay in place and the actual gel is from Anastasia Beverly Hills. Now with the lips I'm going in with a lip gloss from Anastasia Beverly Hills as well. <laughs> um, Saint Topaz. It's a really nice pinky gold color. It's super nice and then for the spray I actually use the Morphe Continuous Spray Mist. It's one of my favorites. It's really really nice. It's super, super lightweight, and it feels like you didn't even spray anything, but it just feels good, like it has a nice scent, and it's just a really good spray. So, as you can see, it's just all about the face and about the eyebrows, in my kind of opinion. I think that that is what should be done when you wear glasses, because people are not going to be able to see your eyeshadow anyway they and they are going to be able to see your lashes so you have to go like a honey with the face and the lips and the brows so yeah i definitely hope that you you definitely learn something and please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to this channel and don't forget to tell a friend to do the same and i will see you guys in the next video on wednesday bye